Hey guys, this is Battle Productions, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon, and what do you want? Can we talk? Um, sure. We had fun talking to Zumro, and he seems happy. Okay. I'm not sure what's happening, but we got special music, so it has to be pretty special. Oh, connection orb. Okay. Interesting. So, we connected with somebody without doing a quest. Okay. Oh! I made a connection with a Blissey and a Rotom. Or is that a Chansey? And Azumarill's introduction? Connects us with Azumarill. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so last episode. Well, we find... Well, we do a quest and then we find out that Behem is definitely after us. And that is quite scary. Actually... No, we went to Relevation Mountain, and then we found out the Behem were here. So, yeah, that's kind of scary. So, we're kind of thinking, okay, um, <clears throat> yeah, that's kind of scary. We don't know, maybe, if this is a good place to go, stay? I have no idea, but we're going to have to find out. So, Connection Orb, we're going to have to do a quest in order to move on with the story. So, let's decide which one we're going to do. We have three of them. We got a, one with Lillipop, and we've got one... Bayleaf, I wonder. Oh, must be that. Okay. Come on. Let's see what come on is. Battle Pantsier. Okay. Sure, we'll battle Pantsier, I guess. <laughs> Whatever you want, buddy. We'll take you out. So let's go. So yeah, we're gonna go to the Cave of Training. We have to go to the fourth floor. Let's do this thing. Okay, so, yeah, we'll just go with this preset, and let's bring a tougher Pokemon around, because I'm not sure what level Pants here is. Let's bring, hmm, let's bring a water type. We'll bring Whiskash. Seems like a good idea. And we'll give an item to Whiskash. We'll give him the special defense looplet. And, yeah. The pot, okay, do we need anything, really? I wouldn't think so. Uh, let's just deposit our money, I guess. And, oh crap, that's what I, okay, let's go. Here we go, cave of training, floor number one. Okay, so it looks like we got ourselves a Pokemon here to fight, this uh, Tyrant. And we got a burn. It took it down in two hits, not bad at all. And, let's see. Oh, there we go, stairs right off the bat, that's pretty good. Excessive force, what's that? That sounds very interesting. Intro, okay, it slightly boosts your attack, and this gives you an excessive force when you defeat an enemy. Okay, seems interesting. I'll, I'll try it. Let's go second floor. Okay, got some poke right here you can pick up. Oh, okay, Machop. Interesting. Oh, a bunch of Pokemon. Oh, okay, I like this. Got a bunch of Pokemon that can attack. Oh! Okay, thank you, Whiskash. I appreciate you taking that, even though it completely missed you. So, let's see. Got more money. Got a slow... Oh, Whiskash. Picking up some stuff here. That's pretty cool. Sometimes I like it when they wander off. Sometimes I don't. But it's, in this case, I like it when they do. Because it kind of gets me items, and that's pretty cool. Okay, so we can get that. And what's this? Uh, guard boost. Give that to Jake, I guess. Okay, we got a Helioptile here. And we'll Ember that thing. And pack its face off. There we go. Perfect. Okay. And we got the stairs. So, Cave of Training Floor 3. Yeah, we got this. This is going to be quick. Mud Slap. Wow. Dang, okay. They're all doing... Oh, we're already at the next... Oh, man, we're going through here quick. Okay. So we got an Orenberry. Do we really need it? Mm, what can we get rid of? Well, we have a Plain Seed right here. Let's change around our leaders. We're going to have Whiskash become the leader. So, yes, we're going to be careful. Let's move on. Oh, I see. It's like a Panseer group. Find and defeat the leader. Are these, is that all of them, or what? 
Okay, let's, um, right off the bat, I guess, go for a water gun. Hmm. Let's see what they're all gonna do. Incinerate. Oh, that sucks. They're gonna eat our, they're gonna incinerate all of our stuff. Okay. We're gonna use a slumber orb then. They're all gonna fall asleep. And let's all take out this one pansy right here. Or yeah, duh, Michael, you can take that one out too, whatever. We're gonna lower this guy's accuracy. Boom, he's gone. Oh crap, I did not mean to do that. Ah, uh, crap, this is not good. Incinerate. No! Stop taking, stop burning my stuff! We're gonna mud slap this, kill it. Stop burning my, no! You idiot! His accuracy went down, Jake is very low. Let's not use it. Uh, no. Come on, take this guy down. Ah! Okay, fine. Use the Reviver Seed. Okay, let's see. Let's see how it's Mud Slap again. Lower its accuracy and kill it. So, yeah, the YouTubers won! Yeah! Thanks for a battle. You really are strong. Connection Orb started shining. And we got connection. Connected! Not bad. Now, let's see what else we got here. Got a Smeargle and some other Pokemon. I can't really tell from because it was all zoomed out, but that's pretty cool. So there's something ahead, but you want to skip the dungeon? Yes, let's go. Yeah, Whiskash was definitely a good Pokemon. I like it a lot. So no more expeditions today. That's good. But they burned all my stuff. That sucked. Looks like we're done for today. Hey, Michael, don't you think we're getting a lot better at this? <laughs> I'm feeling more and more confident lately. Let's pick up the good work. Maybe we can graduate our junior status. I mean, I, mean, I think we can handle real expedition society work now. Yeah, we definitely can. No doubt about it. Jake's really excited, but now maybe this isn't the time. I'm afraid those behem are rather going to show up than sooner or later. Whatever happens, everyone will be caught up in my problems. I can't let that happen. Guess I just have to leave here. I, I, I here I have to say something to Jake. Huh? What's wrong, Michael? You got a look on your face like you were hit in the stomach or something. What? You actually attacked by those sus suspicious Pokemon and you escaped to Serene Village. And now these Pokemon are right outside the village and you're going to leave to protect the other villagers? But, but, I finally have a friend, but, well... I know you told me you used to be a human and you were different. I didn't know you'd been through all that. I wish we could be together. We could be together forever, but I'm afraid they were worried about the other villagers. I guess I, you have to leave. Oh, I'm crushed. At least I was for a second. If it has to be that way, then I know what to do. I'm gonna leave the village too. What? This works out nicely. I've been waiting to work to get out of this silly old village. Anyhow, we got a lot stronger, so we can make it our make our way into the world. Okay. Even if those behem or whatever they call attack us, we are better off battling together instead of all just by yourself. So that's it, Michael. We're gonna leave the village together. I need to go home and work on convincing my old pops. See you tomorrow, Michael. Just as headstrong as ever. I think Jake and I are strong enough to battle as behem now, though. Maybe it'd be a good idea to leave together. After all, I have to talk to Nuzleaf, too. Who? what I want now? They be him or just outside the village. And you don't want to cause any fuss for everyone else, you say. Well, you're fixing to leave. It doesn't even know the villagers have been so good to me. And that exactly, I can't let anything happen to this village. I see. I accept. I reckon I can't let you leave the village. What? It ain't like the Mbihim already found you. And there's no way to tell if some rumors if it really the Mbihim. If you don't care, the Mbihim can just find you out there. I reckon you should wait until, wait it out here. I ought to say you put it right here in your village. Got it? Nuzleaf. That sucks. I didn't think he would oppose me. From now on, Roselia and Radicate told me it has to be those Behem. Why is Nuzleaf trying to stop me? But if he says no, I can't just I can't just up and leave the village anyway. I have to, I, I just can't find those Behem and come find me. I just can't let them find me here. What am I gonna do? It's no use. I have no clue what to do. I guess I should just sleep on it. I wish I could just sleep like that. If I'm stressed about about something, I can't just go lay down just like that and just be like, oh, all done. Nope. No, that that doesn't work that way. The next morning. Okay, let's go. Let's see how Jake handled the situation with his pops. 
Oh yeah! I wonder how things went out with Jake. You fool! How many times do I have to tell you? It doesn't matter what you say! I want to go! I want to get out of this village and join the real Expedition Society! I want to join the Expedition Society and see everything this world has to offer! Why can't you understand that? Oh jeez, something like it's not going well. And I keep telling you, it's dangerous out there! It's not just me who thinks so, everyone in the village agrees! Don't you have any common sense? I guess I don't! Maybe it is common sense, but I don't think really everyone thinks that way! Well, where do you think you're going? I'm gonna talk to everyone in this village! I will see what they think! Oh, Michael! <laughs> Why can't my old pops understand? Let's go, Michael! What? Where? To the plaza! I'm gonna ask everybody to see if they can make it outside the village. I, I, I think everyone knows how hard we've been working lately. I'm gonna prove my old pops wrong. Let's go to the plaza! We have, we have to ask all the other villagers! Alright, well, let's do that. So we're gonna have to go and talk to every single villager? That's gonna suck. Why do you say you're gonna leave this village, but is Caracosta okay with that? I'd be worried. Are you guys going away somewhere? Yes, we are going away somewhere. Far, far away from here. So I guess let's go in here? I need to tell. What? I need to tell someone about Z. Oh. And we had fun talking to Unknown, and Unknown seems happy. Oh, okay. I guess every day there's someone we can talk to here. That's pretty- I wish I knew that from the beginning. I'm Unknown Z. Unknown Z getting sleepy. So, Connection Orb is shining. Yeah! So, we got another Pokemon connected to the Connection Orb. That's awesome. Let's see what he opens up connections to. Other unknown. So, okay. Cool. Hopefully we can get the whole alphabet sometime. Jake's already said these things. I think it's dangerous. What overweight? Of course not. Where are your manners? You're both leaving? Well, you said you two are leaving the village. How reckless. Welcome to the Cafe Connection. Oh, there's no rewards. Okay, well, we already did that last episode. We got quite a few things. Well, you want to leave the village, but you're still just kids. Should I just wait until you graduate from school? No, not at all. Ah, we don't need school in the Pokemon world. Are you kidding me? Let's talk to you. What? You're going to leave our village? The two of you kids, I certainly have been impressed by the work you have put lately, but I still think rushing away from the village can be a reckless move. There's school to think about, too. I think you better hold off a little longer. Well, let me cackle on shop. Nope. Sorry. Let's see if there's anyone up in the school. You never know. There really isn't, but let's just start exploring. Oh, what's that? We got a petrify orb. Cool. Is there anything up here? Nope. Okay. And there's no one in there. Okay, I guess there really was no one in the school. I mean, school is out after all, and uh, it was just possessed. Well, not really, but you know. Still, there were people there. Oh, Magnezone. Unbelievable, outside the village. I can't allow you to do that. Many dangers lurk outside the village. You are leaving here? What a terrible idea. Far too dangerous. Oh, huh, the you two are going to lose this trip. Oh, Jake's always dreaming about leaving the village. But if you guys are gone, I won't, I won't see you at school anymore. Wait, I want to talk to you. There you go. Huh? You're going to leave? Oh, in that case, I'll really miss you. But the part of me does want to see you achieve your dreams. Wouldn't it be hard, though? All the grown-ups will definitely try to stop you. Once you say you're leaving, it's too soon for kids like you to take leaping from the top, top row to get strong. Hi, craw! Watch me remember. Ah, uh, no, we're not gonna do that. Sorry, buddy. Let's see. What? You say you're leaving the village? There's no way you can pull off something like that. The girls never let you. Oh, you say you want to see the outside world? There's no way. Okay, well, let's talk to the Lombre. Why are you gonna leave the village? No way. There's absolutely no way you can make it out there. I mean, you guys are still kids. Uh. I think it's the last person, maybe. What do you say you're taking a trip? What about school? What about your studies? And another thing you're sure you're gonna be telling your teachers this? What a teacher to do in a spot like this. Oh, I guess that was the last person. Okay. Oh, uh, my old pops. I guess he was right. I all the grown ups said we couldn't make it. I guess there's no way as long as we're kids. Yeah, I know. I know we're just worried about us, and that's nice of them, but I wish they would try to understand. I mean, that's my dream to leave, and what it takes to take a lot of courage. Hey, Michael, I just realized something. I acted like I was going along with you in the village, leaving the village. But that's not the truth. I've always dreamed about being the Expedition Society. I've always dreamed about leaving the village. So really, if I, want, if I weren't here, I would have wanted to leave. That's how I've always felt. But, uh... Jake. Sorry, Michael. Looks like we can't go together. Oh, actually, about that... What? Those leaves said no! Uh, I, so you've been told not to leave the village, too, but those behem are still after you. What won't they understand? Oh, just thinking about it is making me tired. I don't feel like doing anything. I think we just go home. Oh, 
I wish... Uh, huh? Just now, I could have sworn we were being watched. Maybe it's just my imagination. Or is it? Is it the BM? Oh my goodness. This could be bad. I didn't see those BM today either. Maybe I should just stay here in the village like Nuzleaf says, but if they, if they did show up here, what would I do? I mean, I guess you would flee at that point. That would make him leave the village, but whatever. Okay. So I guess let's leave and do. let's see what goes on here. Good morning, Michael! Let's go get him! What's going on? This is a major attitude adjustment from yesterday. I guess everything's fine. Hey, Michael, can I ask you for your advice some, some for something later? Advice? Yeah, I did a lot of thinking last night and realized something. Let's just talk about it later. For now, let's do our best as junior society members today. Okay. Well, I guess we could go and do some stuff here. Actually, is there anyone here to talk to today? Because, oh, nope, it's just Azumarill. Okay, I was thinking maybe there might be someone else to talk to, but no. Oh, well, there's an Ursaring here now. I don't know if you should be eager to evolve. You end up looking like me. Well, that's a great idea. You look sweet! I really can't wait to evolve. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, do we have any money on us? Yes, we do. We have a little bit. So let's let's at least restock, because I know some of our stuff got burned from that last mission, and that was quite terrible. So we'll buy one more tiny reviver seed and probably we'll buy one more apple. So there we go. That should help us out. Oh wait, we have to at least get a uh, quest going. Let's see, what do we got here? We have three options. We have a Smeargle, a gathering. What does that mean? Go to Smeargle's secret base at Uprise Range. That seems fishy. I'm gonna see what else is around. Okay, that. I guess we'll help Lily Pop. I mean, it took us this long. I want to. What do you want to do? Um, no. Sorry, buddy. I guess we're... <laughs> no choice. We're going Smeargle. Yeah, I guess we'll go to his secret base. Uh, that seems kind of fishy. So, I think I should take another Pokemon that's quite strong. Because, yeah, secret base, that sounds a little crazy. I mean, it could be good. I have a feeling it could be bad, though. Especially if it doesn't tell you what floor it's on. Hmm. Yeah, um, uh, what's, uh, member selection here? Let's not take Volpix, even though it is at our level. I feel, let's see, what's a good Pokemon to take? Ooh, I would like to take Tyranitar. That'd be fun. Actually, kind of want to, ooh, it has Sandstorm. I wouldn't want to have Sandstorm. Uh, that's dumb. Uh, hmm. I kind of want to bring a good Pokemon. In case there is something go wrong. You know what? Let's bring Dragonite. No. Let's... Ah, whatever. Let's just bring Dragonite. I kind of want to bring Dragonite. I mean, yeah, technically... I said earlier in the Let's Play that I shouldn't... I'm not going to bring any high-level Pokemon to dungeons. But it really, it just makes it more convenient. So, yes. Yes, Dragonite's going to be the leader. And we're going to be... I guess we'll be grinding on the way, too. So, I mean, why not? Let's just wait until he comes over. You're just going to harden? Fine. Be like that. Okay, there we go. And let's go for Twister, I guess. Woohoo! Oh my gosh, that was awesome. Okay. No. Water gun. Okay, that did one damage. Haha, <laughs> suck it. Oh, we miss. Lovely. Critical hit, that's nice. Um, Twister. There we go. Well, let's just keep moving. Okay, we got a bunch of Beldums here. Do we have anything that's good? Fire Punch! Yes, that is great. Yeah, that's perfect. No, oh, no, oh, this is so good. Let's see, let's go... Twister, I guess. Goodbye. This is good training for all of our Pokemon. So I guess this isn't too bad. Oh, Slumber Trap, that sucks. Okay, there we go. Okay, cool. Let's... Okay, I think we might need this, so let's pick this up. Let's swap it with... Is there anything that we... A uh, plain seed. Yes, we'll do that. Second floor. Hopefully it's not, like, too long. We reached the floor where Smeargle's waiting. Okay. Kind of curious on wh what... I mean, secret base. I mean, that could be anything. He could ambush us. It doesn't mean... It, it would give us more teeth Like details if if it was something good so I 
I don't think that this is a, gonna be a nice mission. Oh, let's see. What the? Okay. Oh! Okay, I guess it was better than I thought it was gonna be. Take good care of my friends, won't you? Okay. Um. Okay. I guess I could. I guess that's a good thing. So we've been connected. Cool. I was kind of worried. I mean, since they didn't give us that much details, I was afraid it was like an ambush or something. But yeah, I guess that's fine. We'll just leave. That was quicker than I thought, and yeah, that was pretty empty. Okay. Cool. Now let's see what advice that Jake wants to, uh, wants us to answer for him. Good job, Michael. We put in good work today. That reminds me, didn't you have something you want to talk about? What could it be? Yeah, about that. The thing is, I'm going to go ahead and leave the village anyway. What? I'm not going to go tell anybody. I'll just sneak out tonight. I know it's not the best thing to go about it, but I, think, I can't think of any other way. I'm, I'll set off for Lively Town. I'm planning to go there and join the Expedition Society. I'm ready to go by myself, but what are you going to do, Michael? I want to join the Expedition Society with you. Partly because we've been working as Junior Expedition Society members w a while, and just being around you makes me feel stronger for some reason. What do you say? Will you come with me? Uh, yeah, I will, actually. Really? Yes, I don't like sneaking away like this, but when I consider the Behem leaving is my only option, I've got no plans beyond getting out of here either, so I might as well join the Expedition Society with Jake. Th thanks, Michael! Alright, let's head home and get ready for our journey. We can be up in front of our houses once it's nighttime. Hasta la vista, Michael! Or, hasta la vista, Michael! Oh yeah, Jake with his good impression of the Exterminator. Let's do our best, Michael! <laughs> uh. Huh? I feel like someone's watching us again. Oh, jeez. We're going to get ambushed right here. But no one's there. Something's not, there's something that's quite right here. Uh, maybe I'm just imagining it. Okay, maybe there's not anything bad going on. It's been dark for a while now. I guess it's about time to leave. Nozleaf, thanks for everything. I'm sorry about sneaking away like this. Um, you know what? I think I'll end the episode here. Just because I'm at 22 minutes and I don't know what's coming up next. So, hope you guys enjoyed. And, yeah, next time we're going to be sneaking away to, for Lively Town. Hope you guys enjoyed and see you guys next time. Oh, be sure to go check out check uh, check out Pro Victini's Let's Play as well. Yep. So, that's going to be it. Like I said, see you guys later.